I don't have anything on them. But basically, as far as I could get, this is off the top of my head as well, so it could be wrong. Make sure you look it up if you're actually interested. But this hospital um, was planned to be built for the 80s, 90s. I know the construction started, obviously, because I'm here. But it was never completed. They spent about 150, 160 million euros on building this massive university hospital complex. Which looks like a COD map. Maybe a sick COD map. And they never finished it. It was never used. It just laid abandoned. And there isn't any security or any fences at all because, you know, if you injure yourself, you're an idiot, then you should pay for your own medical bill, first of all. Second of all, they didn't have enough money to finish it. Why would they have money to have security? I'm gonna very, very slowly get to the top floor. Well, never mind, because on the third floor, there actually is some panels. Thank goodness. So, it's not going to take that long to get up. It's actually a whole catwalk they finished up here. not on the top floor just yet but there is this, this side is one floor lower but look how much the roof is sagging it's like puddles formed good view of Zagreb and its surroundings You know, you don't realise some things until you do them, but I'm rather scared of heights. Because that, to me, is rather high. A uh, little bit jelly legs. But I will make it into the middle building, see what the middle building is, before I very quickly go downstairs to pee myself. But it... I can't get over the size of this place. What made them think that this was like the correct thing to do? Surely if you built it in like phases, then it would have worked better. Oh God, it's immense. There's a car over there actually. I don't know. found out what this room is for because well I don't know I don't know about these ones because it's just a concrete slab but in here this is the the top end of the the lift shaft so there's this very small hole down there Obviously, nicked all the stuff, and I don't blame them. Actually, come to think of it, all the other wire harnesses inside the building seem to be fairly intact.
it's weird I'm not scared of heights when I'm in a building. It's when I'm on top of one. It's really weird. I've got a long way to go. On my way down, I've realised I've seen a lot of these things. Oh, yeah, insulation. I never really bothered to look at them, but there's a lot of them. They're bloody portaloos. <laughs> there's tons and tons of portaloos, presumably for the workers, but like they're properly into the in the building. I've seen similar things travelling around Croatia made out of plastic, like little corner stores that are just plastic cubes that are just preset as so you can chuck them all over the country. It's weird. Peppa Pig. Is my lift coming? Is it anywhere? It's just the void inside of that one, because all the doors. It's funny how the button still works. No, that one's not there. Below where I actually got in. I wonder if I find the staircase, bloody hell. Right. It goes lower. It's one more floor, floor deep. It's spooky because it's even got painted walls. So this is like the proper sort of facility area or the maintenance I'd say considering the paint of the wall there's no like cladding on them so just painting them straight on Jesus Christ it's massive There was a ridiculous amount of glass involved into this building because even the spaces that didn't have windows had glass. It's sort of like a, it, to me, it's like a proper 90s building. There's glass everywhere. This, there, in fact, there are some buildings in Zagreb that like that. The uh, big football stadium they have is just, it's just all glass. Even that's still half abandoned, even when they use the pitch. I don't think there's anything in this next section, this next part of the building, but I'll, I'll give it a quick look. You can see in this room it's all fenced off. And they still got girders, bits of metal either left or these were supposed to go somewhere in the structure but the you know the job got called off before they put them up. A little storage room, K5. I've now entered where those lads were messing around and have disappeared so now I'm the one who's going to get scared by them oh, there's, uh, there's boxes and stuff down there oh, I want to go down there I want to see what's in the boxes that is really weird it's the underside of this building no wonder I can see stuff they're actually using it as storage. That's really weird. And it has electricity in there. There was lights running all the way down it. It's so bizarre. Oh, there's another line of storage in here. And that's the, they're the boxes that I saw from upstairs. So there's all these emergency exits. All these have like 
temporary roofs on them because they never finish but these ones are finished so they've got a glass roof on them and this almost looks intact all the glass in this one staircase out of seven <laughs> although it looks like that these this is the only one with the glass inside of it like that oh keep going it actually looks like it's all intact it's what the building was supposed to look like oh no well it's too good to be true there's a couple of panels missing but that is the majority it's like i'm stepping on snow it's weird weird glass So I'm currently very close to the boiler roomy bit that looks finished. I can hear voices. There was a digger and I can hear it on the other side. But I heard the towers. I think these are the two rooms with the boilers in. But I can see over there and it looks very well maintained. There's a the guy in a van, so. I'm not going to go in there because that looks like a trap. It doesn't look like I can get out. Not, not without struggling. But I think this might be it.